YouTubers! We're on the A52 near Grantham and we're going to a place called Botsford. I think it's called Botsford. This is a little bit interesting, so I thought I'd just stop, whack the camera on my head and film it. It's in the seven well, it's not seven after, it's a seven and a half ton weight limit except for access. So we need obviously access, it's the only way in. It's not massively tight, but there is a nice blind side reverse into it. So I thought, what the hell? What the hell will film it? Might as well, aren't we? A bit wet out, but the sky's looking good. I think it's possibly going to become a bit nicer soon. But I have got wet this morning. I don't like getting wet. It's not good. Now we're going to go in a slightly different way to the way the Pratt now is telling us to go in. Because if you go in the way the Pratt nav told us to go, there's a ridiculously tight turn. And we don't want that the ridiculously tight turn. So we'll uh, go past the first entrance. So we're on the A52 in between Grantham and we're heading towards Nottingham. first time I do this, did this, it's always interesting when you're doing it for the first time and you start seeing seven and a half tons weight limits everywhere, you know, oh, you're not entirely sure where you're going, although I've done it a fair few times now, you travelers, I know what I'm doing, fully experienced, don't you know, well, I can look like I know what I'm doing anyway, same thing, I wear a high-vis jacket and look confident, Everyone assumes you know what you're doing. So that was the first turn in, the way we don't want to go. Because you get a bit of a tight turn in, we don't want that tight turn in. You shall avoid that. We're going to take a street route in. Bit of local knowledge, YouTubers. Bit of local knowledge, it always helps. Google Maps also helps, but I don't have a phone. I've got a cab phone for the lorry, but all that does is make phone calls. So I haven't got the luxury of Google Maps. I can't do it. There's the first one, there's this one, and there's one further down as well, and every one of them seven and a half ton. So there's not a lot we can do. You gotta do it. But the difference is there's a little plate underneath that says except for access. Or except for loading, that's it. Except for loading, so we can. Because we are, well we're not loading, we're unloading, but same thing in it. That's the only way in. I'll say there is three different ways. The first way, that's also seven and a half ton weight limit and there's a ridiculously tight turn. And there is the other one, I sometimes use that one if I'm coming from the other direction. Again, it's seven and a half ton weight limit though. And can your lovely car drive a nice and polite? Like him, I shall give a nice polite wave and smile. I shall give him my best hairy smile. He'll like that. Oh, I can feel the sun now. The sun's nice. The sun is nice. I can work on my lorry driver's suntan. Get one tanned arm.
Yes, yeah, so it is one of those strange places, a seven and a half ton weight limit, and then you think, well, why did they put it down here? But then it could have been there first and they built the houses after. But some of these houses look quite old. It doesn't look like a new estate, does it? go. Two lorries. So they've probably come to the same place. Now there isn't a parked cars on this junction of us before. Could be because of the virus. But if we'd have taken the first turn in we would have come from straight ahead and then we'd have to take that right turn. And last time I did it, I have done it once, was parked cars right the way to the edge. I, I got it round, but by heck it were tight. By heck it were tight. There were parked cars literally to here. <laughs> well, that monument on your right, it made it really tight. So we could have actually took the first turning with, with no cars there, but you never know, do you? I now know that there are sometimes cars parked in that junction, and it's probably best not to. Like I say, a bit of local knowledge. The trouble is they don't, they don't show that. If it's your first time here, don't show it. And you won't see it on a map. So unless you've got Google Earth, or Google Maps, or whatever you call it, Google something, which you chaps might have, or chap S's. A little bit tight around there. You just gotta be polite and wave. Smile. Try not to upset the locals too much. So that's where we're going to. On the left. And there's no room to turn around. Well, normally there's no room to turn around in there. So we're going to be going in backwards. So we boys have got some uh, reversing to do. A bit of room though. We'll be on the blind side. Here we go. I'm not as good, I always confess. On the good side, I can put it anywhere. I'm not as good on the blind side though. I'm not as accurate. I'm not as confident on the blind side. But we're doing all right. Take a time, doodle our way in. Just coming round, we're near enough there. I think it's time to take it off very quickly. Van there. It's not too bad, we're a little bit wide from the kerb, but we're round now, aren't we? We can straighten him up now. We're good, we're good. There we go. That's the hard bit done. Ooh, I saw the hard bit. I'm going screw with on the easy bit now. Sun was in my eyes, YouTubers. We shall blame it on the sun. I'm not used to sunlight. I'm octurnal. That's the first good thing, we haven't hit the gate. That is good, that will impress them. They will be happy for me from leaving the gates alone.
ਮੇਰੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਮੇਰੀ ਦਾ ਹੈ Hold it. There we go. We're in, you little bars, we're in. Right, let's go get his pallet off. Well, that's me tipped here. Nice and early today. I'm going to be an hour and a half. I'm going to Grantham next. I'm going to be an hour and a half. I'm booked in there for nine o'clock. <laughs> No, 9.30 I'm booked in. I'm going to be there for about 8 o'clock. Oh well. Just check. I've got this in the correct position. The one good thing with this COVID-19 virus, I don't think I've been late once since, it's, since the outbreak. No traffic. I'm pretty much running early everywhere. So when the non-important people turn up and they start whinging about wait, late deliveries, so I'll shoe lock that caused me to be late in the first place. Clogging up the roads of the unnecessary car travel. Cutting us up and brake checking us and... There's none of that with this. So easy. Right, back out the way we came in. And then to Grantham. You can go to Grantham by turning left, but it's down very tight, narrow country lanes. You don't really want to go that way. This way is actually a bit longer, but it's a bit safer. You haven't got the wing mirrors in the hedge and the rest of us, if you meet something big coming the other way, you've then got problems. We'll go the slightly longer but safe route. It's a nice little river. I suppose it's quite a nice place to live here. The only thing that ruins it is the damn lorries driving through every 10 minutes. <laughs> Honking the air horns? Should I? No, I won't. I'll be kind. I'll be kind. Go on. No. No, no. Thou shall not blast one's air horn. I could turn left, but it's just easier to go straight on. It just is. And basically he's coming in the same way I come in, so I ain't doing it wrong. He's doing it and all, it ain't just me. Being a cattle though, I assume he's local. So he knows what he's doing. Not that I don't know what I'm doing. I always look like I know what I'm doing. Just don't tell anybody. I've only got a moped license. Shh. Yes, there we go. I don't think we have to worry too much about the school today as they're all shut due to COVID-19. No schools. There we 
go. And we're back out onto the uh, A52 to Grantham now. It's a lovely day. The sun is shining, we're an hour and a half early. Could it be any better? I was saying that, it's sunny over there. We're going that way and it's sunny over there. It doesn't look so good over there. Bad place to go Nottingham, I would say. Grantham is good. Good is Grantham. Go, go, go. Oh, a little spin. There we go. You only will have it. Seven miles. Right, have fun. Only a shorty today. There's not a lot interesting going on, and the rest of the day, they're all big, massive places where you could swing a Ford Fiesta around. So, toodle-roar, have fun!